Hey everybody, it's Matt from the house and I am here with Mr. Joe Sexton and we're gonna check out uh, some of the 21, 22 public snowboards, give you a little sneak peek, a little teaser for you. Let's check this stuff out. All right, Joe. It's good to see you, buddy. It's, it's been to, a while. It's good to see you too. It's been a while. Yeah, so let me ask you this. How many years has it been for public now? This is our fifth year. We're actually, though, this will be our sixth year that we're showing. How? It seems like just like yesterday, I know. I it know. was like, hey, I'm starting this new brand. You want to buy some boards? Yeah, and it feels like 15. Yeah. But... <laughs> <laughs> the days are long and the years are short. <laughs> yeah, but no, I remember that hitting you up when the first boards came out. Yeah, and... no, it's it's pretty insane. It's stoked to see that everything's going well. Thank and you very much. Obviously, uh, you know, when you check out this middle board, you can see exactly how well it's going. Uh, <laughs> but uh, yeah, right off the bat, let's start with your board, your new board for the next season. Yeah, this is the Public Disorder. This is the 152. This is uh, the my pro model for for next year, and kind of want to talk about the graphic. It was kind of a funny story. Our art director Josh and my good friend, he brought over a blank coloring book. Just and, random coloring. Yeah, book. it was like, here, just take a couple days and like draw these in, fill these out. So I just like did it over the next couple days, gave it back to him. Not really sure what he's going to use it for, and then turn it into the top sheet of the graphic, which is pretty sick. That's amazing. Yeah. It's always good too, like you just realize that somebody's not just dropping some shapes on a board. Yeah. It's always nice to see that, uh, yeah. see that graphic story and find out exactly where they came from. He puts a lot of thought, we all put a lot of thought into, into the graphics and a lot of energy and stuff. So I was really happy with the way this one came out. This is a shape that I've been a little more into riding. It's, it's a micro camber. Okay. So I had like a flat to kind of rocker shape in the past, but I'm kind of feeling this more micro camber, a little more stable board. It's the um, best for 50-15 uh, rails that are, you know, as long as your road is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess. I mean, it was. it's cool just to look down and see like a really good, like classic nose shape. Yeah. I've always gravitated to that. We have aramid stringers coming through the base, through the, through the whole board from the nose to the tail cool. to give it a little more stability and a little bit more Kind of like also add some pop too. So sure. I've been around this board the last two years and I, I love it. Awesome. Yeah. So yeah, so now let's check out uh, this board that yeah. we did this year. Yep. Um, and a little bit more, it's one of the first, it was the first directional board, right? Yeah, directional twin. Yeah, yep. so give us a little hoo-ha on that one. We did a directional twin because that's something that our team rider really wanted. That Ben wanted a directional twin board, something he could kind of ride sort of all over the mountain. He obviously takes it on rail trips, but he'll ride in Brighton backcountry with that board, the bigger size. and. And he's even hit me up like, can I get a 59 to hit some bigger jumps with? So it, the board can definitely do it all. Super, super versatile. Yeah, very versatile. It's got um, it's got aramid stringers in a V shape here for more stability cool. and a little bit more pop. It's got it's got some Kevlar coming through. It's got some carbon strips coming through here. Um, but yeah, directional twin, and, and that's something that Ben designed from the ground up and like built like his dream board pretty much. So Sick. we're happy to announce Ben's first pro model with the brand and well and deserved. hopefully yeah, very well deserved. <laughs> and we surprised him earlier this year with it, and it's been been a really cool experience. Awesome, and now this one right here, yeah. this is, uh, this thing's pretty, pretty rad, so. Yeah, we're excited about this. We got a Vans public collaboration, and there's yeah. actually a whole collection with boots and everything, too, the, the Vans has to go along with it, so. Yeah. But new board for you this year, too. New board for us, we, we got, they, I mean, they helped us top to bottom do this whole collection, which is so rad, and, and gave us the tools to develop a new mold and build a new board and really got behind us. We were flattered that they wanted to do this with us. It came about because of Daryl Mathis. Been on Vans forever, been on Publix since the beginning. And they kind of asked him, what, you know, what do you want to do as far as like working with somebody? Let's do something with Public. So we were, we were, we were honored and, um, and it's really been a pleasure to work with them top to bottom. So board, boot, shoe, jacket, sock, and then we got a video project coming out with it. So Head to toe. it's a whole thing, but, but yeah, this is a brand new shape, brand new board. It's, it's regular, it's regular camber. Okay. It's a mid wide and it's got quad carbon. It's got four carbon strips here, Woo. which is awesome. And then, and it's just like kind of that a little bit more updated shape than we usually are doing, but nose kind of there. a little more blown nose. And, and it's even like got little details of like, this is actually matte to gloss and, and the whole graphic story and everything really ties in with the rest of the package and stuff too, so. Yeah, it looks right. And these Thank are kind you. of in the sole of, it's like a clear sole on the boot yep. and on the shoe. Yeah. You can actually see this graphic. Exactly. Through the sole, which yep. is pretty rad. Exactly. This actually looks exactly like the sole of the shoe. Yeah, so. yep. So it was cool to keep it all consistent. And, and like we said, jo I mean, Josh and, and everyone at Vans, like it was a really cool collaborative process. And unfortunately I can't ride too much of it because I ride for 32, but I can look at it from a distance and get stoked for it's sure. It's all right, yeah. it's all right. Yeah. All right, cool. Well, Joe, thanks for meeting up with us. I can't wait to go Thank out and you. ride. And uh, yeah, if you guys got any questions about any of this stuff or any of the other public stuff at thehouse.com, leave us some comments down below. We're on there every day trying to answer your questions trying to you know get you into the best stuff possible and uh yeah 
like, subscribe, get that bell on, and uh, yeah, even if you ride Vans boots or not, it's all right. You can still grab yourself one of these boards next season and yeah, get out absolutely. and ride, because yeah. any day of riding is a good day of riding. Yep. Thank you.